What's up, everybody? We out here at Ling Camp Prong and the Great Smoky Mountains. We're gonna be catching brook trout today. We actually standing right here behind the prong right here. We gotta go hike up, go past these waterfalls and everything with my brother and Ryan. And hopefully we can get it done today. I'll show y'all later how we do it. But until then, let's go. Man, it is ridiculous. I just can't hook them. Can't hook them at all. I just, no matter what I try. There we go. Got a, got one. I'm all in the tree. There we go. He come up and hit the cork. So. They don't get very big over here. They only live about four years in the Smoky Mountains. But you can see, got the red little fins on it, the little spots on the side. Just a real, real pretty fish. One of the most pretty fish you'll ever see. Beautiful, let's see if we can get another one. All right guys, I brought myself my GoPro. Look how pretty. Just caught. My fourth one. It's been a struggle today. Didn't want to really bite too much. It has been hard to hook. Didn't want to bite too much. We're gonna catch a little release on this dude. So I'm over here. I just caught another one, but I don't have my adapter for this GoPro right here. So here we go. Got another one, pretty one. Catch a release on him. Look how pretty they are. They don't get very big, you know, 11, 12 inches in the Smokies is a trophy. And this is like four and a half, five inches, you know? So this is really probably one of your average fish, especially up here, you know, so. So we've been struggling all day. Finally, Ryan finally caught one. Pretty, pretty. Can they see him again? All right, brother just caught his first one. It's done took us down there all day. After 100 misses, finally catch one. It's just hard to hook them, you know. We caught a bunch of them, but we had a pretty good first day in the Smokies. And uh, stay tuned for the rest of the Smoky series. And uh, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Later. All right, guys. I hope y'all liked the video. Make sure to subscribe, drop a comment, drop a like. Hope y'all like the hat. This is a brook trout hat. This is why I got this one in Tennessee when I was out there. Uh, ended up catching a few brookies. The last time was easier. And I'm just not very accomplished fly fisherman. And I'm trying to lead the way. So it's like the blind leading the blind. I had a little bit of experience, and I've done it before. So I caught a few, and then I tried to get them to get on a few, my brother and Ryan, that is. And it uh, just didn't really happen that well. Um, Ryan did catch like a 14-inch rainbow, which was a big rainbow in the park. You know, in the park, them wild fish, they're not hatchery fish. They get, you know, they're smarter. I mean, it's just what it is, what it is. And uh, I ended up catching two rainbows. Check out this rainbow right here I caught. Beautiful rainbow. Bye, buddy. So if I have anybody who watches my channel and you fly fish and you're from the North Carolina, Townsend, Gatlinburg, Pigeon Forge, anywhere up in that area around that state or whatever that's willing to hook up me and go fly fishing uh, and teach me some stuff, I'd be totally down for that. Put that down in the comments. I'm probably not going to come back out there until next year, but if you want to just meet up and hang out uh, at that time, or if you want to come out down here and we could swap up trips, like you, te you teach me how to fly fish, 
and I can bring you down here and we can catch some redfish and whatever else you want to catch down here. You know, we got a plethora of species down here. So thank you. I appreciate it. Y'all let me know uh, what I just said. Put it down in the comments. And I'm going to check y'all on the next one. Later.